caring was at the very centre of it. And uh, this sort of took shape during the First World War. Um, um, she volunteered for service as a, um, what I think was called a BAD, which you and I would probably call a nurse. In the early years of the First World War, uh, she met Archie Christie, fell in love with him, and married him. And he was a soldier and later an airman, a very brave man who fought in the First World War. And that was the basis of the next part of Neymar's life. In 1922, Archie got a job as financial advisor to the British Empire Exhibition. And they traveled all the way around the world um, from South Africa to Australia to Canada and back home. And this was, in some ways, I think, the high point of Neymar's marriage to, to Archie. Um, when they got home, slowly but surely, um, Neymar began to write um, books and obviously became quite preoccupied with them. This was roughly the time when she wrote The Murder of Roger Ackroyd. And Archie uh, became very enamored with playing golf and eventually met a young woman at the golf, at the golf club who um, he became infatuated with. And this was all to end with Archie saying that he didn't love her, her, Neymar any longer and he wanted to go off and get married to Nancy. At the same time, uh, Clara, who was quite an age by that stage, um, became ill and eventually died. And it was, I think, the confluence of these two situations that made Neymar eventually ill to such an extent that she um, eventually, in inverted commas, disappeared, um, went off to Harrogate in North Yorkshire and um, forgot about herself as an individual. Eventually somebody found her and she came home. I think it was a mixture of loss of memory and intolerable sadness and almost despair. When all the things in which her family life had been based um, up right up until then, um, her mother and her husband um, all fell to pieces. And I think most of us, if those kind of events happened together, would have experienced not only sadness, but maybe, um, but maybe something even worse than that.